In this video, I'm going to take you with me on a 20 mile training run in preparation for my upcoming marathon. It's go time. Let's get after this. Shoes are on. It's time to start this thing, man. We're in the inner urban trail. We're we'll taking this all the way down along the lake into U Dub. That's about 10 mile stretch. And then we wrap around Lake Union, back into U Dub, and over to Green Lake. That'll be 20 miles. So, you ready? I guess so. Let's get this. Three, two, one, go. We are off. We'll be doing this for the next three hours. <laughs> There's the beautiful Lake Washington over there. All right, check in, check back in with you guys as much as I can. All right, mile one. We're at 9:39, mile one. So still just settling into the run a bit. Still very much in the honeymoon phase of the run. Where everything's enjoyable. Beautiful sunny day. Got warm now. The legs are feeling good. One mile in. 19 to go. Mile two. Ran a little bit quicker. Ran a 9.17 that one. So might be getting ahead of ourselves a little bit, but still in the honeymoon phase. Feeling good. Feet are fresh. Caleb is dealing a little bit with his tape job. It's kind of bugging him, but hopefully we can crank through it. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. My heart rate's 154. Two miles in, 18 to go. Beautiful day. All right, mile three. Mile time was 922. We are just under 30 minutes in. Mile three, it's time to take some salt shoes. Just on the grind. Keep it moving. Three miles in, 17 to go. All right, mile four. First gel. Like a 9.25 pace. And we've been doing this routine where we stop and walk for 30 seconds to take the gel. Mile four, 16 to go. All right, mile five. Pace was 9.33 for that lap, mile five. Time for a salt capsule. Five miles in, 15 to go. We're running for about 48 minutes now. Feeling good. Trail's still beautiful. Lakes still feel fresh. Let's get it, 15 more. All right, mile six it was 940. So a little bit slower, but we're still averaging a 929 pace. We are now just under one hour in. So about two hours left. A little over two hours left. Same. How we feeling? Better. Feeling better. Six miles in. 14 to go. Legs are feeling fresh. Honeymoon phase of this run is slowly fading. We're staying strong. Okay, mile seven. That mile was 9.29. We're about an hour and seven minutes in. Feeling good. Mile seven means we'll be taking another salt chew. Keep it going. Mile seven, 13 to go. Let's get it. Okay, mile eight was a 910 second gel. A little 30 second walk to take this gel. About an hour and 16 minutes in. Mile eight. 12 to go. Let's keep it going. Mile nine. Lap pace was 932. We did the tail end of that mile at about a nine minute pace to make up for the 30 second walk. Feeling good. About an hour and 25 minutes in. Nine miles down. 11 miles to go. Oh, 
All right, mile 10. Mile pace was 9.05, so we're going quick on that one, but officially halfway there. How we feeling? All right. 10 miles in, 10 miles to go. Officially the halfway point. We're an hour and 35 minutes in. Halfway. Definitely honeymoon phase is over. Now it's all the meat potatoes. Halfway, baby. Meat potatoes, yeah. Mile 11. Mile time, 9.05 again. So we're kind of cruising right now. We're feeling good. Yep. Pain is setting in a little bit. It's starting to feel a little winded, but mile 11, nine to go. It is salt shoe time. Salt shoe number three. Keep grinding. We just passed you, Dub. Coming up on Gasworks. Mile 11, baby. Keep them moving. Hour and 44 minutes in. Mile 12. Lap was 913 mile. Hour and 53 minutes in. Walking for the third gel. We just got to Gasworks. The beautiful city. Almost a third of the way. Eight miles left. Let's get it. Another quick update. Just so you can see the city. Gasworks. Beautiful Seattle. Space Needle hiding back there. Beautiful day for a run in Seattle. Mile 13. Lap was 10.09 because we walked for that gel. Half a marathon in. Two hours and three minutes in. 13 miles, seven to seven to go. We made it to the Fremont Bridge. Starting our loop around Lake Union and then back into UW. Salt capsule time. We're gonna keep grinding. This is where the grinding sets in, half marathon in, seven to go. Time to grind. Mile 14, lap page 919, it's grinding, we're almost to South Lake Union, just keeping at it, Caleb's been dealing with his Achilles pain and it's starting to tighten up on him right now so he's going to try to push through as long as he can, he might have to hold back, take care of his body but we're just pushing, doing what we can. It is. Two hours and 13 minutes in. Just over 14 miles. Six to go. He's gonna try to get to 15. Grinding it out. Let's keep at it. There's the space needle. Made it to South Lake Union. Space needle. Beautiful South Lake Union. Mile 15, pace 924. Kill had officially drop off. His Achilles got really tight, so he's just taking care of it. So I got five more miles by myself. Just looped the bottom of Lake Union. So heading back north into UW. 15 miles in, five miles ago. It is complete grind mode at this point. You just don't want to run anymore, but he's got to grind through it. Two hours, 23 minutes, just about. Grinding. Five miles left. Let's do it. Mile 16. Pace 908, last mile. Two hours, 30 minutes in. Fourth and final gel. 
to the 30 second walk for this. Heart rate 176, just came up a massive hill, so. 15 down, just four to go, let's get it. Mile 17, mile time of 9.30 on that one. Two hours and 40 minutes in. We made it to the University Bridge. Back to UW. Seattle's back behind me. 17 miles in, three to go. What's that one guy say on TikTok? It's hammer time. This bridge is a bit of an uphill. So it's gonna be a grind, but three miles left, let's go. Mile 18, mile time 924. Two hours and 50 minutes. We we're back to UW. I went to class in there before. I've been to classes in here before. Old stomping grounds. Coming up on the quad with the cherry blossoms. Two miles left. It's hammer time. Look how busy this is. busy it is for cherry blossom here but all right two miles left let's grind this out come on all right mile 19 lap time 922 in the last mile running for coming up on three hours now 19 down one to go one more mile let's grind this one out we just came up UW, which was so hard because UW was just an uphill the whole way. But now we're back on a downhill heading to Green Lake. Feels fantastic. But 19 miles, one more mile. Let's flip and get this. About to hit 20. 20 miles. Oh. Mile 20 was like an 8.30 pace. We picked it up a bit just to finish. 20 miles. Oh man. What a run. So that was 20 miles, three hours, seven minutes, 39 seconds. Average pace of 9.23. That was brutal, but we did it. We did it. I gotta meet up with Kale, but let me catch my breath and then I'll update you guys. Found him. He did his 15, I got my 20. Went to PCC, got some water, some watermelon, LaCroix. How's Achilles? Sore. My legs are shot, man. I will say though, I've had 40 miles on these shoes now. Oh, I can wait out here. The Cloud Monsters, they're so good. You gonna get some stuff? Yep. I'm gonna chug this water. Then we're gonna reassess. I'm dying right now, but feels so good to have that done, complete. 20 miles later. Well, 15 for him, 20 here. He's been dealing with the Achilles issue, so he doesn't want to push it too bad because you don't want you don't want to just be pushed through. He, he doesn't want to push it too bad because you don't want to. <laughs> He doesn't want to push it too hard because you don't want to like get to that point where you're just gonna ruin your Achilles and during training you want to be able to like still make it to race day so trying to get as many miles on it as you can and while maintaining the health of it so he got a good solid 15 
I got a good solid 20, finished the 20. Already up to 4,000 calories burned for the day. It's only 12.30. Five weeks out from the marathon. We got four more, four more big runs before the race. Today was a real good tester. 20 miles in, I would still have six miles left to do on race day, which is just unfathomable. Marathons are no joke, man. They are just brutal. Easter Sunday tomorrow, I'm gonna splurge a little bit. Some cake, some good food, <laughs> a good time with family. But most importantly, celebrating the resurrection of the Lord Jesus Christ. He's alive, he is king. Amen, Amen hallelujah. But uh, yeah, let's get some food. We got the goodies. You go get tacos and burritos. Now we got to decide what ice cream we're getting. We decided to go with a chocolate M&M brownie. And then we're also going to do some Tillamook mudslide ice cream. I live in one on one. So yeah, that'll about wrap up this video. 20 mile training run. Thanks for coming along. About five weeks out from my marathon, my first ever marathon. So uh, next weekend we only do a half marathon, but we're supposed to do it at race pace. We'll probably try to run that like at 846 mile. And then we have a 21 miler the weekend after that. So we have one more really long run there. But thank you guys for watching. Thanks for joining me on that 20 mile run. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.